You enjoying that? Mm. Well, it was a shame to let it go cold. Yeah. Well, that's my breakfast and that's my sea. Oh, you're very possessive. Don't worry, I won't keep you long. What do you want, Gary? Well, actually, it's what you want that bothers me. So, I saw you coming over to Maria's this morning. Yeah, and what? Well, that's my girlfriend. Ooh, he's being possessive now, eh? Well, you can do warm me off for you, Gary. No, I'm not trying. You're going to stay away. You know, I'm amazed that you're not wearing animal skins. I mean, you know, times have changed and all that. I mean, yeah. women can think for themselves. I mean, they even got the vote, so I guess Maria can decide who she wants to be with. Oh, I'm sure she can. But it's not you. Yeah, I mean, you'd be surprised. What, we're talking about the kiss now? Yeah. Yeah, you see, we don't have secrets. Unlike someone. So if you ask me, you gave her a sob story, she felt sorry for you, kissed you, and then regretted it straight off. Yeah, well, until she tells me differently, I'll back off then. No, no, you're backing off regardless. Now stop asking her. Oh. Trust me, you don't want to find out. Enjoy your breakfast. Hey, it's, uh, it's me, it's Ali. Listen, guy, come on, I've uh, got something to say. Hey, uh, thanks for letting me in. Listen, uh, we really need to talk. About what? Where's Maria? Now, if you knew her as well as you say you do, you know that she was on the school run. So what are you doing here? Oh, you're not listening to me this morning. Listen, spare me your tough guy routine, OK? You might be able to intimidate our writing, but I've been face to face with scary people than you, Gary. Oh, you think so? You really don't know me yet, do you? <laughs> we see that's where you're wrong. You recognise this? And where'd you get that from? Where well, you tried to hide it. You should be more careful in your line of work. Give it here. No. No? Not until Maria's seen it. She won't be long. Look, I don't know what you think you've got there. Oh, I think I've got a complete record of your dealings as a loan shark, OK, in black and white, or should I say, black and blue. And once Maria's seen this, you two have finished, mate. So much human misery. How's the Louise old, Gary? You haven't got a clue, mate. Yeah, it all seems pretty clear to me. But I don't know what you're capable of. I mean, the sooner Maria's away from you, All right, all right, all right, that's enough. <laughs> I mean, look, I know you probably want to smash my face, but we both know Maria's going to walk through that door any minute, and the last thing that you're going to want her to see, well, apart from this... What? No, I'm... I'm not bothered about that. Well, what are you going to do? Try and pass all these names off as bits of furniture, I suppose, uh, Where's Halliday's a sofa bed, is he? No, Maria's never going to see it. Oh, is that right? Well, what do you think's going to happen? It's just going to self-destruct, is it? <laughs> no. No, I think you're going to hand it over. I think you're going to walk away and you're going to stay away. I think when you see me and Maria out, you're going to cross the street. You're not even going to look at her. What are you on? What am I on? Mm. Where's your phone? Let me give you a little tip. Don't leave valuables in your coat when you go for a wee. Not even in Royce, because there are some very dodgy people about. Give my phone, Gary. So, I was hoping to find some text between you and your dealer. Oh, don't we try to imply Don't waste your breath. I know it all. It's me. Where are you? You're going to be late for the disciplinary meeting. Look, I know you're feeling anxious, but if you're going to convince them that you're clean, the last thing you need to do is turn up high. So if you're out there looking to score diazepam, it's going to be the end of you as a doctor. Is that really what you want after all your hard work?